Hello, here it's Kamoto here. Today I want to talk about strings. What kind of guitar strings do you use for your uh, acoustic guitar? And as you know, there are so many choices to choose, right? And there are different brands, different thickness, uh, different materials. But I want to talk about uh, non-coated strings and coated strings. And this is a corded strings. And I think uh, you, pl uh, you put your corded strings maybe once in your uh, guitar uh, career. And I know some people like it, but I know some people hate it, right? And today I want to compare. Um, this is called uh, the Dario XS uh, corded string. And this is pretty new uh, uh, string, which came out, uh, I think, last year, in 2022, 21. I'm not sure, but, but recently, uh, using uh, a lot of new technologies. Um, before that, a lot of coated strings uh, were pretty thick and very slippery. And compared with those, uh, this is coated string, but still, uh, very thin, uh, ultra thin uh, coated, but still it is different from the uh, regular non coated string. And uh, I mostly use this as a phosphor bronze at the Dario uh, for my shows. And I use this one for the guitars, I don't use much because uh, I have several guitars. If I put this for all the guitars, while I don't play, the strings get old so easily and so quickly, right? So uh, this is good for the guitars. I don't use much. And, uh, you know, some people like it. And be benefit of this one is, uh, you know, it's obviously it lasts much longer than this. It prevents the rust. And then uh, it can sustain the good pitches too. So that's a benefit. And another benefit, I'll show you later. Uh, I'm gonna demonstrate with the guitar. Uh, string noise, uh, less string noise. So if you play, and your strings ch -ch 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 noise bothers you, uh, this might be a solution. Although, I would recommend uh, practice uh, to do, get rid of your string noise. You uh, improve your technique. Because if you rely on this, you don't improve. And I love this string. It's a very uh, same old uh, phosphor bronze. But the thing is, uh, string life is not so long. And especially I play shows, and sometimes I play uh, 12 shows a month. And I usually change my strings uh, once in two weeks. And sometimes once a week. Because uh, this uh, dies so suddenly. Uh, that's uh, that's the thing. Okay, I want to show you this. I put uh, this uh, quarter string on my fifth string, and then uh, sixth string is uh, non coated as you see. So coated one is a kind of yellowish color, and this is more like a brown, little brown. And I want to, I want to play, and then I'm not sure if you can the, hear the huge difference, but it is, it is different. Okay, I'm gonna play the fifth one, six. This is coated. It. 
it's kind of hard to tell the, the sound quality, but I think it's, it is different. Um, quarter string is a little brighter than uh, non chorded I mean, it depends on the thickness too, I mean, different thickness, so, but... Uh, and also feel. I want to show you the string noise, okay? For example... If I do this kind of thing... Okay, let's see. I'm gonna start with the quartet strings. I'm gonna play the same string and same phrase. And now non chorded This. Yeah, I think I, I mean I can I still hear the noise on the chorded one, but I think it's a little less. So yeah, that's a benefit. Um, so what I suggest is uh, you don't have to uh, buy all the different strings. Pick two. Uh, regular one and coat it and then try both um, you might like it you might not like it i mean depend on your uh, personal taste but lastly i wanted to share because uh, uh one thing i did was uh if i put this uh coated string uh excess on the new guitar it sounds kind of bright, clear, new, as I expected. But I have an old a vintage guitar, and when I put the regular strings, sometimes I feel like uh, it's too woody, or too, how can I say, too root-oriented sound. But when I put this one, it can change to a little bit uh, modern. I'm not sure if it's the right time modern, but uh, you know what I mean? Like uh, it added a little more clarity or brightness on that the guitar, and which I liked it actually. So if you have a vintage guitar or old guitar, and if you feel like that guitar is a little too muddy or woody, you can put this one. And uh, let's hear how it's gonna sound like. Okay, so today I compared quoted, non quoted. And if you visit uh, the Dario website or like, Alexa website, you can get more inf information about quoted strings. But I hope uh, you can get some ideas my, from my personal experience. And uh, I hope you enjoy the video. Thank you very much for watching.